I mean, hey guys, I just have a quick question. So um, if your spouse cheats on you um, or your boyfriend or girlfriend cheats on you, will you take them back? Or is it like a wrap the first time? For me, the first time you cheat on me is a wrap. And let me tell you why. Because I'm going to always, I already have trust issues. So if you violate my trust in that capacity, I'm never trusting you again. So for me, the type of woman that I am, I know that I wouldn't be able to take you back and believe that you're going here and there. I'm going to always want to be there with you. I basically, I'm going to feel like I got to hold you hostage because of what you did to me. And I'm not going to be able to get over it. And I'm going to throw it back in your face. And that's why I am in no position to take someone back after cheating. So after it's one time, it's done and over with. And with marriage, I mean, I'm young and it's like, you never know what you'll do, but I know me and I know that as of, as of right now, if I got married and my spouse cheated on me, it would be over and done with. That is the ultimate disrespect. I feel like the ultimate disrespect is stepping out on your partner with another person, period. That's the ultimate disrespect. Like spit on me, on my shoulder, not my face, but on my shoulder, but don't cheat on me. Well, that's not a bad, that's a bad analogy. What I'm trying to say is like... I'd rather you, I would rather you mush me in my face than to cheat on me. Like abuse is not okay. And mushing in the face is not okay. None of that. But I'm not promoting that. What I'm saying is I'd rather just be into it with my partner and have one argument or have arguments and it get a little uh, intense rather than deal with somebody who cheats on me and they don't, you know, they don't have any anger issues like I have a short fuse, so it's like, you know, I don't put my hands on anybody or anything like that, but I hope I, you understand what I mean. Like, I'd rather deal with certain things rather than cheating. Cheating is just not it for me. I can't do it. Like, once you do that, you violate it. There's no coming back from that for me. It's over with. Once I find out for sure that you stepped out and you, you, you was with another female, like, I can I can forgive, like, okay talking to another female it depends on what level if you was texting another girl okay you was texting another girl I could probably deal with that I'm not gonna leave you over text messages but if you was talking to a girl heavily for a couple of months for even a month like you have a whole side chick it's over with it's done so you only have a little leeway that's it you don't have no leeway to cheat on me but text messages and you know Maybe um uh I if I find like a a DM or whatever the case may be, I'm I'm gonna be pissed, I'm gonna be upset. But my like but the probability of me being with you still is higher. Now, if you go sleep with a female, that's it. It's a wrap. Sex is that's no. Mm -mm. I don't want you anymore. You're for the community, your community pool. Everyone is swimming in you. Chlorine is not enough to disinfect you. I don't want you ill. Like, no, I don't want that. So for me, one time cheating, sexual intercourse, I'm gone the first time. There's no forgiveness. I'll forgive you, but I'm not, I don't have to be with you. I'll never be with you again. Texting, DMing girls, you'll get cussed out. And, you know, I'll probably stay, but... When it comes to that, um, like that laying in bed with another person, mm -mm, no ma'am. So I want to know if someone cheats on you, will you give them a second chance? Do you believe in second chances or do you cut them off automatically? Me, I cut them off automatically. Um, when it comes to like cheating, like, you know, sleeping with another girl, automatic cut off the first time, no second chances. So I want to know if you believe in that or if you believe in like giving a second chance if they were to be in bed with another person um, or get caught cheating in any kind of way. Like what is your standard? Because um, I'm a no-nonsense type of female. Like just the thought of text messages pisses me off, DMs. That may be minor to people. Flirting. I don't, ooh, I don't like that. Flirting, that'll get you broken up with. I'll probably get back with you, to be honest. But 
I'll leave you for like a brief moment because you need to understand that that's unacceptable. I'll probably be back though, but I know for sure what I won't be back for is that it's, it's the bedroom boom. If you do that, it's over and done with. I don't want you. You for the you for the streets. You're a stray dog. You're the community pool. Mm-mm. You the whole block. I don't want it. Mm-mm. You're the whole avenue, the whole street. And so tell me, you know, you guys, if you believe in second chances or if it's like an automatic cutoff um, the first time.